Hey, what's up guys? Fonzie Mods here with my first tutorial video. In this video, I am going to show you how to set up XEX menu. Alright, so we're going to start off with getting your XEX menu, alright? What you're going to need is a flash drive that has been formatted on your Xbox 360. So grab a flash drive, plug it into your Xbox 360. You want to go to settings. Let's see... Yeah, you're going to go to settings and then system, then storage. You're going to go to your flash drive. You're going to press Y and then you're going to format. All right. You're going to need it to be in a FAT32 format. So once, once you have your flash drive, all right, you're going to want to open up Horizon. Any of the links to uh, from here on out to all my videos, they're going to be in a link in the description below. All right. So... What you're going to need right now, you're going to download Horizon and you're going to download Xbox 360 Neighborhood. They're going to be in the link below on my Dropbox. Just get it, download it. All right. So once you have uh, Horizon, you're going to right click and you're going to run as administrator. Click yes. All right. Once, oh, you're also going to need XEX menu. Duh and dash launch so it's gonna be links to my Dropbox alright so you're gonna go into XEX menu 1.2 and you're gonna download this folder here and then you're going to you know go to Horizon you're gonna download that so but we'll get to that so plug in your flash drive is this the right one uh, no it's not they have one that's already been formatted that I've been using. There we go. All right, perfect. So once you have XEX menu downloaded, you're going to inject new file. You're going to click that. You're going to where you saved it. So wherever you save that folder, go to it. All right, so this is my mods folder. XEX menu. Shut up, Cortana. You're going to go to that folder, open this folder, and then it's going to be this. All right, so you're going to open. And, oh, I already have it on, so just put overwrite, yes. And you're going to see the little progress bar right here. Awesome. All right, so you're gonna take your flash drive out and then we're gonna go to our Xbox. So I don't really have any fancy screen recorders. Um, I'm gonna have to get one soon. All right, so we're gonna go to settings, system, storage. <clears throat> you're gonna plug in your flash drive. All right, there it is, so what do you, USB. It's going to be in demos, okay? So go to demos, you're going to press A, move. It'll ask you to sign in if you're not signed in, so just go ahead and sign in. And you're going to move it to your hard drive. So let it do its thing. Awesome. All right, now, so take your flash drive out. You're going to go to recent, and there you go, you have XEX menu. And this is what allows you to access all your games that you have downloaded. It'll give you, I already have Minecraft for some reason. Uh, you know, it'll let you run Dash Launch. It has all your stealth servers, all your mod menus. But yeah, guys, that's how you download uh, and install XEX Menu 1.2 onto your Xbox. Uh, my next video, I'm going to show you how to get Dash Launch, which that's the one that you use to, you know, change any settings to get online, your mod menus, your stealth servers, you can even change like the fan speed. You can do a whole bunch of stuff. 
But yeah, guys, you know, stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow my Instagram. Uh, again, all the links are down below, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.